Hello, this is Vane, and this is another video on a doll that I've been working on. And um, this doll that I got, well, I got it at the flea market for $2. Uh, she still has a price on the bottom of her foot, a 3 but um, the lady sold it to me for $2. And uh, she was in pretty clean, good condition. The only thing was that um, her hair was rooted and it, even though I tried to, you know, untangle it, um, every time I would brush, I would just get handfuls of hair. And I've noticed that in bigger um, size dolls, like th these 18 inch dolls, when their hair is rooted, it's rooted very loosely so that when you brush it, it comes off. So, um, I wanted to keep her hair. I really like the color and uh, even after I combed it through and I I did detangle it, it was still um, very loose and it would come apart and uh, she had like a lot of bald patches on her head so I waited and see if I could find you know a hair color that would be somewhat close to the hair color that she had and uh, this isn't really close to it but it is blonde and she was blonde so I went with this um, weave and uh, well before before I could glue on the weave on her head um, I had to remove all her hair with um, a pair of tweezers and it was a lot easier to take off her hair than it was for the Madame Alexander doll especially around the perimeter of a Madame Alexander doll it's very tightly packed so it does take some time to be able to pull it out but um, on this doll because the roots were so spread out um, they were very you know loose and I was able to take it off I think in like two hours I was able to take off all her hair and Madame Alexander it took me a couple of days to do that same process so um, it was very easy to remove her hair. In the earlier 1990 versions of Batat dolls, their hair was a uh, wig style like the American Girl dolls. But I, I'm not sure if the newer, newer type of Batat dolls are rooted or do they have a wig. I don't know. This is one that's kind of um, in the early 2000s. So this one was rooted and I didn't do a lot of changes I like I said I did her hair and I also trimmed it straight because the weave was kind of uneven and uh, I redid her lips they're a light pink reddish color and uh, before they were like a, a sort of a brown color I just didn't go with her blonde hair so I, I just painted over and they're about the same um, size as her original painted lips. I didn't touch her eye eyebrows. They're like the same kind of goldy blonde uh, style that, that kind of matches her hair. So um, there it is at the bottom. See I've trimmed it. And uh, well this part is a little bit lower because I parted it um, more to the the left side of her hair but when I part it directly in the middle it is completely straight so <clears throat> that's her and uh, just to, to comment I'm not 100% um, sold on her look I don't know what it is um, maybe because originally she had curls I don't know if I should recurl her hair or maybe I should change her lip color or should I redo her eyebrows um, I haven't painted her nails yet which is fairly easy it just takes a little bit long to do but I will do that and um, as far as any ideas if you have any to improve how she looks please let me know please comment and tell me what you think about her results as of yet Thank you for watching. Bye.